look like you were gonna make it for a little while. Oh my goodness. So, his chrysalis didn't look very good. It was all deformed. There was nothing for me to attach it. Um, they normally um, form the chrysalis by hanging like on top of the tent or somewhere so they can form some silk and hang from that. He had formed on the ground, I think, on the bottom of the tent. Yes, and he didn't have a, a tip for me with silk to attach him. Sometimes I still can, you know, attach him on a rope. I'll show you in other videos or pictures. Um, that's what I had done last year. If they don't form properly or you, they're too close to each other, when I have several like that, um, I rehang him on clips. But I couldn't do this with him, so normally they don't make it when when they're like that. You know, I left him upside down um, in the pot there. I wish I took a picture. I just didn't think he was going to make it. So, wow. <laughs> I'm so glad. It's so exciting. So he's drying his wings right now. Um, apparently he just came out. Um, I came outside with my cat. Hi, Keisha. Do you see we have a butterfly? Isn't that exciting? Yay! So here he is. And she'll look more spread out in a few hours. She's drying her wings right now, so she's uh, pumping liquid into those veins. And. I don't know if you can see, it's like liquid on the ground. She sees wet right now, so she can't fly. And we can't see her much because her wings are still drying, right? So, yeah, I'll take another video for another update in a little while. And we'll see if it's a girl or a boy. I can't really tell right now. I think I see some dots on these veins, but we gotta look in the inside. I'm not too sure yet if it's a girl or a boy. We'll see.